Oh! 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 I like the sound. Oh! That sound tempting. Oh! 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 <laughs> It's 8.15 on Tuesday the 14th, and where are we? Hoffen. Hoffen. I do horrible. Oh, are you kidding me? Look at my hair, are you kidding me? I look horrible, I'm gonna hide. That's the, that's the dramatic Malaysian. Baby German. Guten Tag. Guten Tag. And so, last night I slept uh, here on the grass. That's my bed. Hey, today is very lovely weather, huh? It is absolutely beautiful today. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna go walk on glaciers. And I'm fucking excited. Yeah, <laughs> I'm so excited. So, uh, yeah, I, you can actually see, can you see, you can see some glaciers from here. This place is absolutely mad. And, yeah, so, let's do it. Let's get weird. I'm here with Mariuka. Mariuka, that's it, right? Hi. From Finland. Who's there? <laughs> <laughs> it's YouTube. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. How do you say it in Finnish? Uh, more YouTube. More YouTube. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> <laughs> ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao. Bye. <laughs> nice meeting you. All right, so I'm here at. What's the name of this glacier? Or the name of this place? <laughs> John. I think it's uh, Jakob yeah, Salon. Like Something. Salon. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Jaco Salon or something. There'll be a, the name of it will go right here. Right here. Uh, there's not too many things in, uh, in the world that really excite me more than water, for one. Uh, for two, frozen water. Not, not frozen water in the sense that it's just a frozen lake, but glaciers. Because glaciers are thousands of years old. Uh, they've, they've been, these glaciers have been here longer than humans have been here. Um, and they slowly recede and they carve, they carve in the mountains and, and, uh, well today we have come to a place where <laughs> apparently weird Indian dudes just run around and make noise behind me. Uh, I don't know where I was going with that. However, I am over the moon excited right now because we get to touch glacier water and see some icebergs in the water as well as this place has so many tremendous glaciers i can't even i can't even begin to tell you how uh oh i think i'm in someone's shot uh anywho uh enough enough of me let's uh let's check out some glaciers
anytime I'm near water, I have to get in it. Uh, this water is probably two degrees, maybe three. There's a piece of ice right there that's probably a thousand years old, and I'm gonna go take a bite out of it. sheep over there and we don't want to disturb them so we're gonna walk around this little thing and see if we can actually walk on to the glacier from here it looks like you can get onto the glacier uh, so that's what we're gonna try and do so wish us luck <laughs> Right now we are standing on the glacier. Well, part of the glacier rather. There's a giant piece of ice covered in whatever decomposed, whatever it is. Uh, I don't know, it's really unstable. Yeah, and your you. feet like sink. And it's absolutely terrifying and super exciting at the same time. So we're gonna hang out here for a second and we're gonna try and go that way right about there it looks like there's actual ice that we can maybe stand on uh, so yeah wish us luck because it's pretty dangerous and probably kind of stupid but whatever it's all about the adventure As you can see behind me, there's some ice right there. Well, I mean, I'm standing on a big, humongous chunk of ice. Um, that's part of the glacier. It doesn't look like it's separated. But you can see where it's kind of splitting right there. Hear it falling down. That's what's making me so nervous about being on this. So I don't think we're gonna go any farther. There's like clean ice on the other side of this. I just don't think it's very smart to do it. Um, we might go up this way over here really quick and just kind of give it a, give it a look. If not, this will be the end of a, end of the road. But like I said, I'm happy. I think it's cool. It's terrifying. Uh, we keep hearing what sounds like uh, avalanches or maybe even pieces of the glacier like falling off, but we can't see it. So I think it's maybe on the other side, or who knows? It could just be resonating around through the canyons, but. It's absolutely like heart stopping and loud. I think I caught it on film a little bit earlier, so. Um. Holy shit. We are standing on a glacier in Iceland. And I am over the moon right now. Wow. This is unreal. Mm -hmm. 
this is all ice. Most of it's covered in dirt and whatnot, but you can see spots like say that spot ice is ice, yeah, and it's melting down here. And underneath what we're standing on is actually ice. If you oh, dig deep enough, yeah. Let's see, yeah, that's that like slick spot right there. That's the ice showing through. It's so quiet. It's really, really eerie. Uh, it looks like there's a bit of a, like a ravine maybe we can walk down in and maybe get out on, on out onto the ice out there. Uh, you wanna try it? Let's try it. We did it. We are standing on a glacier. I mean, we were before, but I'm actually standing on ice. I don't know if you can see, but that's that's a solid chunk of ice. Uh, it's not nearly as thick or as uh, slick as I was expecting it to be. It looks like when the I don't know I don't know why it's like that. I can't even speculate. I, I think maybe just as it evaporates, it uh, it makes these like chunks, and they're really I mean they're still slippery, but they're you can grip, uh, yeah. So I, I I don't know I don't know how icebergs or how uh, glaciers work. I'm actually gonna do some research and study up about uh, about them. Um, so yeah, here's what it looks like to stand on a glacier without crampons. Again, don't try this at home. We are professionals. Okay, we're not professionals. We're professional idiots, but. It's so exciting, my heart is racing. It is, it was worth every, it was worth every risk that we took. Isn't that right? Yeah. Yeah. Right. So, um, we're gonna stand up here for a little bit longer and hang out and just kind of absorb nature and, and really appreciate how massive and, uh, and, and really how dangerous and how historic uh, these glaciers are. The temperature dropped uh, significantly the second we stepped onto, hi, the second we stepped onto the ice itself, we were on ice before, but it's covered by what looks like part of the mountain when it sloughs off, it, um, it covers some of the ice and or uh, when the water raise, when the water level maybe rises, it, it, it washes the stuff off. Like again, like I said, I don't really know much about glaciers, but um, it is seriously, a, the, the temperature change was real drastic, probably 10 degrees, Fahrenheit, which I don't know what that is in Celsius, but um, yeah, so we're just gonna kind of don't go too far weirdo yeah. You fall in a hole. We'll never find you yeah. safety first <laughs> So yeah, and I know mom you're watching this just know that I am being responsible while being irresponsible at the exact same time so Yeah, let's get weird Don't want to miss any more videos and you want to come along with me on my adventures then you should probably click the subscribe subscribe button the subscribe button because i'm going to bribe you with a lot of money with no money because i don't have any money but you should still click the subscribe button because it's awesome oh and watch this video because it's pretty good did you click it yet you should probably click it it's right here no it's right here do it. Okay. <laughs>